Hi, I'm Ron Moore, executive producer of Outlander, here with an alternate ending for the episode 106, The Garrison Commander. This is the scripted ending of the episode. It has a lot more voiceover and sort of actually an extended uh, flashback sequence to uh, Claire and Frank that did not end up in the episode. Through the editorial process, I felt that we wanted to get out of this show a little bit faster and a little bit punchier, so we opted to truncate a lot of what you're about to see to the on-air version. But this is an interesting sequence in that it sort of expands the idea of what she's about to embrace and hearkening back to her relationship uh, with Frank in the 20th century. There's also temporary voiceover in here that is not done by, by Katrina Balfe, but is actually our post-production producer, Alicia Bessett. Well, doesn't it bother you that... that I'm not a virgin? Well, uh, no. So long as it doesn't bother you that... I am. Viewed in cold blood, the idea of marriage had some merit. Besides protecting me from Randall, if I was married to a Scot, I would presumably not be watched and guarded. It would be that much easier to get away when the time came. And as for Jamie, well, he liked me clearly, and he knew the Highlands like the back of his hands. He could take me to Craig Nadoon, or at least in the general direction. Yes, possibly marriage was the best way to attain my goal. Except the whole idea was bloody unthinkable. To new beginnings. Hmm. To us and to this lovely battered old world. I used to dream of such a moment. The war over, you and I reunited. <laughs> I just wasn't sure. About what? About me. Or us. In times of stress, the, the mind imagines all sorts of things. We're here. To add the worst for wear, but... Together. Mm, my dear, sweet, funny man. Maybe now you'll believe me when I say that no matter what happens, I will always be your wife. <laughs>